What is up everybody? It is Fitzmiller and Rolls back here with another video. If you guys saw the last one, if you didn't, you should go check it out. Explained I got my wheels and did a couple other things, but this fitment right here, actually it might've gotten lower. I think it got lower. I can't, I can't tell. Anyways, it needs to be lower. So today we're gonna to be removing the front bump stops and in the future, I'm going to re-drill the rear hangers. So let's go ahead and pull this guy into the garage, jack it up. It shouldn't be too hard. It shouldn't be hard at all, but. Also last night I went to hang out with some buddies and this freaking popped out. So make sure you put these back in right. Yeah, so as you guys heard, I have a pretty bad belt squeak, but uh, I promise the belt is tight. I just need a new belt. So first step, we're gonna jack it up, turn the wheels all the way one way, and then take it out. So real quick, while I have the car, well, before I have this side in the air, we're putting on this Style Matters sticker right there. If you guys don't know who Garage Sideways is, you should definitely check him out on YouTube. 240 guy, really anything guy, and uh, just, Great guy, great stories, great videos. So the reason I'm putting it over here is because I don't have a tack. Let's see if I can get it centered. All right, well, I hope that's centered. If it's not, it's not coming up. But, oh, the reason why I said that is this, this is one of his stickers. Styles, style matters. That's his whole thing is style when you're drifting. But I don't, I don't drift, I just wanted a sticker. Let's see what we got. All right, I did pretty good. Let's get to see in the air. All right, so let me turn on the flash. First part of this is you're gonna wanna turn your wheel all the way, all the way out to whatever side you're doing it. That right there is what we're gonna be removing. Got some nice clay on there, it's wonderful. So I'll get a size for that and then we'll start taking it off. Took me a second to break it loose, but it is, a 12 millimeter you guys don't want to watch all of this it's probably gonna take a minute so I'm just gonna knock it out and take it off all right so I can't get this by myself whenever I turn the top nut the bump stop starts spinning too so I'm gonna head over to Carmelo's house right now they're building a box for Cody's ST so we'll get to see a little bit of that going on hope I can get this off this is super easy you know it's literally two bolts and slam so well, after that, I'll probably have to adjust torsion bars a little bit, but again, that's easy as heck too. I'm gonna go ahead and take this down and I'll see y'all at Carmelo's. So we out here, Skyline, ST, mini truck. I've tried turning both of the bump stops now. Hello? Hi. I, you can come over here. Tried turning both of the bump stops and we're just gonna cut them off, so watch this. What we discovered is the bump stop just fell right out. It's like a... It's like a metal cup that just held it, so we're gonna try this. Did this one get cut off or did this one fall this off? One's cut. Uh oh. So I'll try to sim it down. Lit lit. Readjust the torsion bar. Oh, it did. Are you gonna take off yeah. your angry eyes? Yeah, soon. Oh, that's perfect. Hell. Yeah, say what's up. I'm actually recording this what's time. Good? What's good? What's good? Um, can the rear go lower? Or yeah. Just because you're... It's lower than that, actually, but I do need to re-drill the hangers for the rear. But the front just got dumped. It's close. We're getting there. So happy with how this turned out. For the front, just taking off the bump stops and the torsion bars aren't all the way down. Okay, uh, well I need to fix that. Need to fix that, but, but, look at that. Look at this thing. You're really out here. So, yeah, if you wanna go lower, cut your bump stops and you'll be fine. Here we are, 
not sure if we're going to do anything else to it today, but this is just going to be a good, good update for now. So here we go. So happy, so happy with how this turned out. See this, this is a little low <laughs> for my taste, as in I can't, I don't know if it's like that because the wheels turned or if it's like that when I'm driving, but anyways, we're good for now. All right, so we're out here at the auto parks because it's lit up tonight and I'm having my buddy drive my truck past us here so we can get a rolling clip of this thing. Looks pretty sick. Hope he'll not stall it over there. Oh, we're good, we're good. But uh, here, he, here he comes. She's looking good. She's looking really good. He's having fun. I'm teaching him how to drive stick. So may as well do it in the beater, you know? But uh, anyways, I think this will be it for today's video. This has been Fitz Miller and Rolls back here with another video. If you guys like this, like where this is going, like, subscribe, comment, and let's just see where this truck goes. You know, budget build for sure. I'm probably 1200 in right now. Couldn't be happier. So anyways, we'll see you guys later.